गाइस दिस इज मालिंकी वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल वॉइस ऑफ मालिंकी टुडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट मेथड ऑफ स्टार्टिंग एनिमल बिहेवियर यूजिंग टी मेज दिस इज एन इथोलॉजी लेक्चर एंड इफ यू आर न्यू इन माय चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड इफ यू लाइक माय वीडियो प्लीज डू लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर माई वीडियो सो एक्चुअली इन बिहेवियरल साइंस अ टी मेज इज यूज इन एनिमल कॉग्निशन एक्सपेरिमेंट्स especially for cns disorder central nervous system disorders so here cognition means how do animals behave or understand how do they sense something how much conscious they are so t maze is used to study specifically the memory of a rodent through applying various stimuli and it is shaped like the letter t providing the rodent with a straight forward choice let's see the apparatus and let's talk about the specific experiment so t maze this is t maze this contains two turns right and left now the rat is first placed at the base of the maze so here the rat is first placed now a reward such as food is placed at one arm of the maze in this case we have kept food in this right arm now the rat that was placed at the base it is now allowed to make a choice of which path to take like it will turn right or it will turn left now the decision made by the rat can be a cause of a natural preference within the rat that means if it can sense the food it will turn right okay and now the same experiment could be repeated multiple times with no reward in either arm of the maze so first the food was placed in the right arm and the rat was placed here at the base and it was allowed to take a choice so if the rat can sense something it will go to the food properly so we can see that the rat is here near the food next we will remove this food from this arm and we will not put any food here or here and we will repeat the experiments continuously so we will put the rat here and we will see what it does and each trial is monitored whether it can memorize the arm or not okay so if the rat has a good memory it will select the arm where food was placed so each time it will go right if it has certain cns disorder it is tough to remember the place after many confusing trials therefore it will become confused to choose the right path sometimes it will choose right sometimes it will choose left hence it will not be able to reach the right place each time in this way t maze is used to determine cognitive deficits in animals so we have explained all of these yeah this is the last thing that many parts of the brain including hippocampus septum basal forebrain and prefrontal cortex are involved in this task so this is all about today's lecture i hope you liked the lecture if you want to get pdf notes of this topic please find the first pinned comment or the description box thank you